I look and feel like a scuzz bucket today. Uh, <laughs> me and Dad have not been able to shower uh, for a few days because I guess we could have gone up to Grandma's. Um, the pump in our well went out. I, if I get desperate later, I might take one, even though the water is very stinky because our water softener, there is enough pressure to make our water softener generate. So it's real stinky, irony smelling water and there's not a lot of pressure. So, um, we're getting to the point where a couple days out of the shower, we're like, Ooh. um, they came out today, and uh, Dad was hoping it was just a pressure switch. He realized it wasn't the, we thought it was the water softener that went out originally, because I'm like, I got out of the shower Friday evening, and I said, Dad, that water smells. The water isn't softening, it smells horrible. And um, you can even tell when you try to lather up, it just, hard water. No bueno. So... He's like, I, I thought that too when I took a shower earlier. <laughs> so, yeah. It was not the pressure switch. The pump is just uh, 20 some odd years old, maybe 30 years old. I don't know. They're going to come up tomorrow and put in a new pump. So hopefully that will fix everything. But I do believe this evening I'm going to take a shower in the crappy shitty water. Even when it fills up the toilet bowl, it looks ugly from being hard water. So, we've been dealing with that. First, they didn't think they were going to get out here today. Dad called them at noon for the second time because he called them late Friday. And, uh, they got our message and called us and they said they might not get out till later on this afternoon or tomorrow morning. Not 10 minutes after dad tells me that, I hear someone come into the house. Apparently they thought, well, we might as well go stop and see. Because they were here within 10, 15 minutes of after them saying that they probably wouldn't get here till later on. Maybe they were going by for another job and just swung in. I don't know. But, yeah. Oh, I got some of his stickers. So, we're having a water saga. When I made soup yesterday, I used bottled water for the two cups of water I had to use when I put over the potatoes to boil my potatoes and carrots. Because I did not want to use the crappy well water. <laughs> Dad's been using bottled water to make coffee. and um, We have been washing our dishes in it. We're leaving them kind of over where we washed them. Because I'm going to rewash those bad boys when we get regular water. But... Oh. Dad's like, we used to have hard water all the time when, when I was younger and you were younger. He said, it never bothered me then. He said, now two days without, without softened water. He goes, I hate it. <laughs> Dad's like, I forgot what the difference was. Yeah, our sink in the kitchen drips. And where the water drips, it's just like orange rust. Yeah. It's, our kitchen sink has dripped forever. Ron tried to fix it once, but it's, it, he couldn't even get it off there to do anything with it. So we just let it drip. Dad wraps a rubber band around it, try to hold the... It's one of those sinks that has the little... One little thing that you can go cold this way. No, warm this way, cold that way. So he just rubber bands it real tight and it drips slightly. Not as hard, but... We have a drippy sink. Four and a half minutes about water crap. Uh, stickers. Here we go. These are the rest of the ones that I ordered from Redbubble. I got, this is a Wyoming one in honor of Teresa Heidi because she sent some stickers out and they did not get here. So I got a Wyoming one in her honor. And I got this one for the Heidi Ho. And of course I got a sushi one and a sushi one. You know, I have to have sushi on the toilet. 
Then I got these last two, University of Michigan and then Michigan State University for the colleges. Since I got a Notre Dame one, I better get the ones in my state too. My cousin wants to get the Big Ten schools, so we've got a few of them. And my one cousin goes to I Indiana University, so she's going to get me a sticker down there. And then these ones are representing Ohio. Ohio. From uh, Deet Martin on the YouTubes. Deet. That's cool. Even though that's not her name. But. Hi, Deet. Uh, we got Ohio State. Is that a Big Ten school too? I don't know. I got a peace symbol, which I love, with a little smiley face, which is cute. Look, look at my face. Mm -hmm. Okay. Uh, the Great Seal of the State of Ohio. That's a cool one. And then finally, the Big O, Ohio. So, Ohio is covered. I know y'all keep asking me what states I do and do not have. I will go over them with you right now. If I can get this crap back into the envelope. Here we go. I gotta make sure I... Here is what I have and don't have. For Alabama, I have one that says Roll Tide, but I don't really have a sticker that says Alabama on it. So that, Alaska, Arizona... Connecticut, Delaware, Hawaii, I asked Beth, she's going to be on the lookout for one from Hawaii, Idaho, Indiana, which I think I could probably get one of those because since I live like six miles from there, Iowa, Massachusetts, Minnesota, Missouri, Nebraska, Jason, Nebraska, Nevada, New Hampshire, New Jersey, New Mexico. I asked Gigi uh, for, she lives in the ABQ, so she's on the lookout for New Mexico for me. She said, on it. So, North Dakota, Ohio, which I'm putting a check mark next to now, so Ohio is covered. Oklahoma, Oregon, Rhode Island, South Dakota, Utah, and Vermont. I will put the list down here in the cleavage. But those are the states. So are, if any of you guys are in those states, um, kindly look for a sticker. It can just be a little one. I just would like to have all 50 states represented on the crapper. Uh, so yeah, that's where that is at. Dad just left to go make my deposit for me, mail a couple things, and then take Heidi for a ride, and they're going to go out to Larry's. And we finally have sun today. It's supposed to be sunny all week. Because, excuse me, the last few days have not been sunny. been rainy and snowy and crappy. Making my joints not very happy. So maybe this sunny week, although... It's that time. The woman time is upon me, like, within the next couple days. So, wah, wah. Dad just, he ran up earlier and got my prescription for my new um, birth control and my amitriptyline I take at night. Uh, so, yeah. What else is happening? called our city to ask if we had won the bid for the toilet. She goes, we meet tonight, but I will tell you, you are our lowest bid and you are the one being recommended to the board. So she said, I'm not going to promise anything because I've seen strange things happen, but more than likely, it's going to be you guys again this year. So, um, I'm supposed to call her late tomorrow morning because toilets are supposed to go out on Friday. So I just wanted to make sure we had some prepared because they not just want regular toilets this year. They want them with um, hand sanitizer in them. So we got to make sure we get some of those set aside. So many toilets are going on right now, people. 
You just can't even imagine. Uh oh, are you coming to say hi before I get done? Oh, in the box. What are you doing? Hey, your back half's in the box. She's half in the box. Want me to come take a nap with you? If you ask real nice, I'll do it. You don't even have to ask real nice. You could be mean about it, and I still might do it. I think I want a nap. So, I'm off. Happy Monday. Woohoo!